Ready, get slay. Let's learn about the vegetables. Get ready, get slay. Let's learn about the vegetables. Beans, beef, pepper, broccoli. Brinjal, buttercup, pita, curd. Carrot, cucumber, drumstick. Lettuce, potato, pumpkin. Spinach, radish, and tomatoes. These are all vegetables. These are all vegetables and always healthy food. Let's eat the vegetables. Let's eat the vegetables. Let's eat the vegetables and say bye to medicines. Say bye to medicines. Get ready, get set. Let's learn about the vegetables. Get ready, get set. Let's learn about the vegetables. Hi everyone, how do you feel today? Oh great, it's the time to learn understanding the world. Are you ready? Do you remember our last lesson? We learned all about body parts. Today we are going to learn all about vegetables. Vegetable is a healthy food. Healthy living style is very important to everyone. So we have to take healthy food as much as possible. Fruit and vegetables are playing a major role for our health. So if you want to become healthy and wealthy, you should eat more and more fruits and vegetables. You all know about fruits. We learn in Let's Learn About the Fruits video. Today I am going to teach you all about vegetables. First, I am going to introduce the vegetables. After that, I will explain one by one. Vegetables provide vitamins and many minerals to our body. After explaining all the vegetables, I am going to make vegetable sandwich, vegetable salad and vegetable decorations including vegetable Legos with you. So stay with me. Let's begin the lesson. Beans Beans Beetroot Beetroot Bell pepper Bell pepper Bitter God, Bitter God, Bottle God, Bottle God, Brinjal, Brinjal, Broccoli, Broccoli.
Spinach, spinach. Tomatoes, tomatoes. Beans. Beans we call as string beans or snap beans. Beans we can see all over the world. It is green color but sometimes it is yellow in color. It is crisp, thin and long with string. When we make it, we remove the string. Inside there are neatly arranged seeds like beans. We buy beans as cluster. We can eat beans, salad, cooked, steamed or grilled. It is rich with fiber and minerals and also vitamin A and C. Beetroot Beetroot we can see China, America and European countries. It is a root vegetable. Root means it is grown under the ground. It is bulb in shape. We can see leafy part outside. It is dark purple in color. But sometimes, what? It makes our dishes colorful. It has long stakes outside. That are purple and gray. With green leaves. We can eat beetroot, steamed, raw, grated or diced. Do you know beetroot juice is very nice. It is rich with minerals, fiber, full of vitamins, special folate. It's really good for heart diseases and anemia. Bell pepper. Bell pepper is a bell-shaped vegetable. You know the bell shape. It's origin from Mexico and South America. But seeds carried to Africa, Asia and Europe. Now we can see bell pepper all over the world. We can see green color bell peppers, yellow color bell peppers. Red color bell peppers, many color bell peppers. The skin is very glossy. Inside, there are some hollow. It is very light in weight and tiny seeds inside we can see. We can make pizza, you know pizza, right? We all like to eat pizza. We can make pizza, we can make pasta. We can make noodles from bell peppers. Salads we can make from bell peppers. It's rich with vitamin C and many minerals. We can steam, we can bake, we can cook and we can eat bell pepper. But make sure to cook with light heat. To save the nutrients. Bitter curd. It's finely grown in South Asian countries. It is a vegetable hail from the family of God. It is also called bitter melon. It's oblong shape and dull or bright green in color with riddles all over the body. Inside, we can see white, soft, fresh, filled with oval shaped seeds that are crisp and light. It's grown on vines. There are many health benefits. It helps to control sugar level, reduce excess weight, and also good for heart and stomach diseases. We can make juice from the bitter gourd, but it is really bitter taste. It contains iron, magnesium, potassium and vitamins 
A and C. Bottle God. Bottle God also hail from God family. It is long and just like a bottle in shape. Its origin some say is Africa and some say is Asia. Skin is light green hue and also known as calabash. You can see bottle gods hung on vines like bottles and also grown on the ground. Sometimes we can see round shaped bottle gods as well. Inside flesh is white with soft seeds. We can make soup and juice. Juice is very good for weight loss. And also we can make curries, desserts and snack from the bottle god. It taste is bland and helps for digestive process. It helps for avoid acidity problem and good to beat summer heat. Brinjal. Brinjal has a glossy skin and there's a leafy crown the top of the bean. Brinjal. Mostly it is purple color but sometimes it can be white, green and black. Brinjal can be small. Sometimes it's big. We can eat the skin pulp and seeds all. Brinjal we can cooked, fried, grilled or mashed and eat. It is rich with fiber, minerals and vitamins. It's very good for our tummy, blood and brain. Cabbage. Cabbage grown in China, India, Russia and Japan. Layers of leaves tightly packed in a ball. You know the ball, right? Cabbage is just like a ball. It's green color but sometimes very nice purple color. We can make salads. We can make Manchurian noodles, soups with cabbage. Even we can fry it and eat cabbage. But it's better to have it raw. It's rich with vitamin C, K, fiber and minerals. Carrot. Carrot is actually a root vegetable. You all know now root vegetable means it's grown under the ground. It's grown in very cold climate. The shape is like a corn. Mostly carrot is, you all know it's orange color. But sometimes it may be red or pink. We can see bunch of leaves on the top of the carrot. Top of the carrot. We can make juice from the carrot and it is so tasty. We can make stew, desserts, salads from carrot. It's very good for our eyesight. Carrot is rich with minerals, fiber and vitamin A and C. Cauliflower. It's a very nice vegetable packed in leaves resembling 
a big flower. Cauliflower mostly grown in China, India, Spain and Mexico. Mostly the color is white but sometimes we can see purple color, green color and yellow color cauliflowers. We know broccoli. Broccoli is the cousin of cauliflower. We can eat raw salads cooked. Even we can eat roasted and fried cauliflower. It's very rich with fiber and vitamin C. Other vitamins and minerals also we can take from cauliflower. It's very good for our heart. Cucumber. It is really cool vegetable. Its tumbler shape, moist vegetable belongs to goat family. It's grown on climbers or creepers. It has green or yellow skin with a white pulp and seeds inside seeds also we can eat it mostly used for vegetable decorations and also we can make salad sandwiches stew and pickles it's rich with vitamin k fiber and minerals we all love to eat cucumber. Drumstick. It's thin and long. It's just like a drumstick. But don't you speak to the drum. It's a vegetable drumstick. We can call it drumstick as Murunga. It's native in Asia but we can see Africa and South America. Drumstick bodies full with pulp and seeds inside. Because of highly medical content we call drumstick as a powerhouse of vegetable. Drumstick leaves also full with nutrients. Do you like to eat drumstick? Ladies fingers. Why we are calling ladies fingers? It's just like ladies fingers. Tapering one end is just like a long cylinder. It's a small plant grown on tropical climate. Outside green color, inside tiny little seeds that are white and round shape. When it is raw, when we cut it, it's slimy. But when we cooked and fried, it's not that. It's filled with fiber minerals, folic and vitamin C. Lettuce. Lettuce, green and leafy, crunchy and juicy vegetable. Origin from Egyptian. After that, it spread to Greek and Roman. Now it spread all over the world. It's grown in cold climate. It's lovely in salads and burgers. Do you know burgers, right? Every burger, there's a lettuce inside. It's rich with potassium, fiber, vitamin A, C and K. Onion. It's a bulb-shaped underground vegetable. Now, you all know Underground means it's grown under the ground. 
we can see onions all the year round and all over the world. When you cut onions, make your eyes water and burns, but it gives the food very yummy. At one pole, we can see bunches of roots and one pole bundle of green shoots. There's a thin skin outside. Mostly it is purple and pink color. Inside it is white flesh we can see. We need onion for all the dishes. Potato. It's a tube shaped underground vegetable. Underground means it's grown under the ground. It's grown all the year round. Grown in cool climate. Inside it's light yellow color and outside skin is brown in color. If we store potato long time, we can see eyes all around the potato. Potato starch is full of energy. It's rich with potassium, vitamin B and C. We can boil, bake, fry and roast the potatoes. And also we can make French flies from potato. Do you know French flies? It's very yummy with tomato sauce. Do you like to eat French flies? Pumpkin. Pumpkin is the biggest vegetable in king. There's a hard skin and inside sweet pulp, orange or yellow color. Pumpkin is round and big and quite hollow inside. Pumpkin grown on ground on vines. Seeds when dries, we can peel and eat. Taste is fine. We can make pudding, soup and many variety of food from pumpkin. It is rich with vitamin A, minerals, vitamin E and C. Skin and seeds also give many minerals. Radish. It's a good vegetable for everyone. It means uh, poor people and wealthy people both. It's suitable vegetable. It's an underground vegetable. Underground means it's grown under the ground. It's come white, black, purple or red in color. Shape is long, sometimes it may be round. It's very common in Egypt but it spread it to China and Europe. We can use radish for vegetable decorations. It provides many beneficial nutrients and vitamin C and K. Spinach. Spinach has green leaves and highly nutrient content. It's grown in cold climate and we can find all the year round. We can fry it or else we can make salad, soup and curries. Even we can add spinach to the pizza, pasta like dishes. It's rich with vitamin B, C, E and K and fiber and minerals. It helps us to become healthy and free of anemia. Tomato. It's a bright red in color. It's grown on cool places on vines. Taste is tangy and shape is round. 
it has a thin skin and juicy pulp and tiny seeds that are edible to eat. Tomato juice and salads are refreshing in deeds. Tomato ketchup is ideal to eat french fries. Do you remember french fries? We are making french fries from potato. Tomatoes we can eat cooked or uncooked, ripened or unripened. It's rich with vitamin C, fiber and minerals. Now you know many vegetables and what they supply to our body. Vegetables really strengthen our immune system and help to fight illness. The high fiber content can aid in the proper functioning of digestive system and prevent constipation. So make sure to add more and more vegetables to your diet. Now it's the time to explore the vegetables. Are you ready? Hi my dear children. How do you feel today? Oh great. Today I am going to make vegetable sandwiches with you. I know you all love to eat sandwich. Today I am going to make vegetable sandwich with you. Let's begin the lesson. First I am going to introduce what are the things I am going to use today. This is bread I toasted little. Bread I toasted little. This is boiled carrot. This is big onions, lettuce, black pepper powder, cucumber, beetroot slices, tomato slices, salt, tomato sauce or you can say tomato ketchup, chili and garlic sauce, cheese slices, mayonnaise, and butter. Now I am going to make with you. You also can help mama to make sandwiches. When mama boil and cut the vegetables, you can garnish and make the sandwiches. It is very easy. We will go step by step. I'll take the slice of bread and I am going to spread some butter. Okay, the first layer I'm going to add. I already wash my hands perfectly. Okay, I'll keep two beetroot slices and two onion slices like this. You can see I'm going to add little pepper on it. Only little. Then I will take a one slice. We learn all the shapes. You remember? This is square shape. Then I am going to close it. Okay. Then in this slice top of top of this slice I'm going to spread some mayonnaise now I am going to add lettuce and cucumber slices Then, see, little pepper on little, okay, and salt also, little salt because cucumber, we need little salt. Then I will take a 
another slice. This slice I'm going to add tomato ketchup. Okay. Then I will keep The cheese slice on it. Now I'm going to add two tomato slices on it. I will add little salt on the pinch. Pepper powder. Now I am going to add little chili and garlic sauce on it. I will add two carrot slices on it. When I boiled this carrot, I added the salt. I will add another carrot piece. See? One, two, three. Now my sandwich is finished. Now my sandwich is done, so I am going to cut the edges like this. My sandwich is ready. Now I am going to keep tooth toothpicks over here and like this and see this is square shape sandwich so if we give a cut like this this is a triangle shape See our sandwich. I hope you really enjoy this session. You can make sandwiches with your mama. Hi my dear children. Today I am going to show you how to make vegetable salad. Actually, I already diced the vegetables. When you make the salad, your mama will dice the vegetables. First, I am going to introduce what are the vegetables I am going to use now. Here, tomato, cucumber, carrot, onion, lime, actually lime is a fruit, salt, pepper powder and yogurt. Now I will show you how to make my salad. It is very easy. Don't try to cut the vegetables. Mama will cut and give to you. You can mix and make the salad. Let's begin the lesson. Are you ready? First I am going to add tomatoes. Nice color juicy tomatoes. And cucumber. White color and green. Yes, you can see. Now I'm going to add my cute carrots. Orange color. Now I'm going to add onions. Yes. Finally, I will add lime. Really 
uh, lemon actually it is very small piece see okay it's done now i'm going to add salt for my salad this is done and pepper powder if you don't like too much hot don't add too much pepper Yogurt. One spoon. Yes. I put another spoon. I'm going to add another spoon. Then three spoons. Now I will gently mix my salad like this. Now I'm going to make alligator using two bitter gods. We need two bitter gods to do this activity. So first I'm going to cut the uh, uh, alligator's mouth. I'll take a piece of toothpick and I'll put it like that. Open his mouth.
legs to where they did. I make it from bitter gourd. Now I am going to make X mysteries. Uh, for this activity, I need cucumber, carrot and kebab sticks. First, I am using the peeler and peel the cucumber slices like this. Very tiny cucumber slices I need. So that your mama will do for you. Like this, like this tiny. 
tiny cucumber slices we need. I need a piece of carrot for the down for the down part and kebab stick I will take Take the cucumber piece and we will fold it like this. See? Again, we will fold it like this. Again, we will fold. Fold like this. That part you can do and help to your mama. Again, we will put it into with kebab sticks. Now I am going to make a bell pepper train with you. So I am going to use green color bell pepper and red color bell pepper. This train I am going to make 3 compartments and engine. I am using carrot for the wheels of the train. First I am going to Cut the bell peppers and after that I will put wheels. I 
I already cut bell peppers. the carrots for wheels instead of carrot you can use cucumber for wheels I fix the wheels to the compartments I'm using toothpick for this one. Now it's the time to make my engine. So I use cucumber and uh, I will make cucumber into two pieces and after that I'll remove one slide then I'll keep these uh, two pieces together. Now I am going to fix the cucumber pieces with a kebab stick now I'm going to cut carrot for the engine now I'm fixing the carrot to the engine upper part of the engine also I use cucumber pieces Now I am going to fix the top of the engine. with you for sheep I'm using cauliflower I'm using big cauliflower piece to make the body and a small piece for head after that I will cut four legs sheep now you can see
how I am making four legs for sheep. Cauliflower is ideal to make sheep. Now two legs are ready. One more is ready. Now my legs are ready. I am going to use toothpick to fix the parts to the body. I already fixed the head to the sheep and now I am fixing four legs. My sheep is ready. Hi my dear children. Today I made four vegetable carvings. So I'll explain now one by one. You can see on the table. So I already displayed. So I'm going to explain one by one. This is sheep. I made by cauliflowers. For eyes I use uh, two cloves. You can see alligator over here. I use two bitter gods and eyes I use carrot. I fix the legs and the tail to the alligator using toothpicks. Now you can see a lovely vegetable tray over here. I use cucumber, carrot and bell peppers uh, to do the tray. So here engine I made by cucumber and carrots. I use toothpicks to fix the engine. Um, here you can see the three compartments I made by bell peppers and I fix the wheels, uh, carrot wheels to the train by uh, toothpicks and I fill the cauliflower, a spring onion down part and uh, french fries over there. Here you can see uh, Xmas trees. So down I use potato slice this part I have done by tiny slices of cucumber and this part the top of the tree you can see a nice star I made my carrot. I hope you really like my vegetable carvings. You can do these creativities with your mama.
you really enjoy my session thank you so much see you soon bye bye